I'm Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on sequences and series. We'll look into an excellent question, which is very commonly asked in test papers. It's about bottling, bouncing ball. The question here is, a ball dropped from the height of two meters. Each time it hits the ground, it rebounds to 75% of its height. Find the total distance it travels before coming to stop. Four choices are given to you. Now let's try to understand the situation and then we are going to answer this. So let's say a ball is dropped like this. Now I'll just stretch it away to show you what is really happening. And let's assume that the ground is kind of like this. Okay. So, so when it drops down, it goes up to only 75% of the height and then again it drops right so like this uh, it goes and and this is how with time you will see the height right so it is decreasing by 75% we are given that initially the height is 2 meters we need to find the total distance so clearly this is a, a geometric series right where the initial value A is 2 meters for us and when it rebounds, uh, the factor by which it is being multiplied is 75%. So 75% means 0 0.75, correct? We need to find total distance. So as you can see here, distance is coming down as well as going up. So, so the total distance is both up and and down distance this is important to understand correct so uh, let us assume that uh, this continues forever so it is kind of an infinite series so sum of infinite series provides us the solution clear and therefore we can use the formula which is sum of infinite series is the initial value over 1 minus r. Now the value of r is 0 0.75 so it converges right so it is converging series. If r is less than 1 right so if r is less than 1 it can be applied. Perfect. So let's uh, apply this formula and find the sum. So sum of infinite series will give us a values to over 1 minus 0 0.75 and that is equal to what? 2 divided by within brackets 1 minus 0 0.75 which is equal to 8. Well 8 is one of the options however do you think it is the right answer? Well it is not right answer because this only gives you one way right so it is telling you that it was dropped and the second time again it is only telling you some of these distances coming downwards right so how much is the total distance well the total distance is that it is also bouncing back so we have to add those distances which are going upwards also do you see that part so so total distance has been has to be taken so except for these, all other distances are repeated, correct? This is only once. So how do we find the total distance covered? So total distance will be 2 times 8 minus 2 meters. Since it is not going up 2 meters, right? it only falls 2 meters. All other distances have been covered twice right it goes up and falls the same distance so twice it is covering from here to there right so two times this minus two should be the correct answer so we have 16 minus 2 which is 14 meters correct so 14 meters is the right option which is option D so this is very important as most of the numbers here may relate 
some way or the other your values in the solution. However, you should be very clear that when you have a question like this, you could use the sum of infinite series. But remember that twice the total length minus the initial distance, since it is not going up the same way, right? That has to be incorporated to get the right answer. I hope it makes sense. Feel free to write a comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.